Hello, today we're taking a look at Wayward. Ooh, yes, so good. It is a turn-based survival roguelike game that just came out on Steam. Should be interesting. Let's just get right into it and play the game. Oh, play the game, continue or create new. I can't continue something I haven't done yet. Burn in a pit game. Okay, let's calm down. Let's calm down a second. It'll be fine. Oh, who's this? Oh, look, starter quest. Welcome! If you're new to Wayward, this starter quest can help you survive this harsh world by teaching you some of the mechanics of the game. Press J to reopen or close this window. If you don't want help, simply close this window. Otherwise, click complete quest to start your first quest. I like quests. Who is this? I'm gonna call this person Maurice. Hello, Maurice. How are you doing? You got a bun for hair? <laughs> Maurice is also definitely appears to be a woman. I don't know if Maurice is a good name for a woman, but it's your name regardless. Sorry, Maurice. Uh, gear up. Walking around barehanded can lead to trouble. Equip yourself with a tool or weapon. You can open your equipment window by pressing E or by clicking the equipment icon on the top of the screen. Which one of these is the equipment icon? Ah, this one. I don't even know what that is. Is that like a bracer? Kind of looks like a bracer. It's fine. Drag the item with equipped held in its description from your inventory into either the left or right hand on the equipment window. Okay, I, I got this. Oh, look at this. We got so much stuff here. What can we equip? We can equip a large rock, which I do not feel like is actually a good tool or a weapon. I mean, it's a decent weapon. <laughs> But I feel like this stone axe, a durable tool which is both sharp and blunt, can be used to chop wood or mine stone. Wow. <clears throat> My word. Let's see. Your left and right hand equipment slots are interchangeable. You can equip two weapons, two tools, two shields, or any combination in between. Be careful of damaging useful equipment such as torches or shields while gathering or attacking. Make sure to always... Equip another weapon or tool in the other hand if you want to use it to attack or gather or gather over Oh damaging an equipped torch You attack with both hands in combat, so it's important to equip both hands if possible. Thank you very much held items I quite enjoy that we have geared ourselves up. Let's see what we got next Now that you have something equipped try gathering from trees and rocks to get the following resources Gathering without a tool can hurt your hands. I would imagine trying to punch a tree down, contrary to what Minecraft would tell you, is actually rather difficult. Trust me, I've tried. Kind of. It was a sapling. Actually, it worked pretty well because it was a tiny... Don't worry about it. Anyway, um, let's see. So make sure to keep replacing them as needed. It may take a few tries to get the proper resources. Don't give up. Okay. Oh yeah, look at that. We got some movement. Maurice is moving around. Oh, okay. So we just have to move into the thing to uh, do some damage to it. What do we got here? Tree bark? Why are we getting tree bark? Maurice, why are you getting tree bark? I don't want tree bark. I want legit wood, Maurice. Come on. Maurice does not know what's up right now. Oh my word. What is this? What is this thing right here, Maurice? Examine it. What is it? Amber? Fossilized tree resin can be melted down to reinforce items. Oh, well, that's nice. I enjoy that. It's quite, what is this? Is this a box? It's a log! Yes! Logs are the best. Logs are the best. And we got some more amber. We just need to find some rocks. Oh, look. Rats. Oh, shh. Be careful. There's rats about. Pretty sure we can whack them with our axe and kill. Is that a slime? What are you doing, slime? What is this? Is this a shiv? No, it's a feather. Feathers are very different from shivs. It does have to be said. I'm not 100% certain we should be down here. I'll level with you. A fossil? Nice. I think we might have gone a bit too far from our original position. But quite frankly, I'm not finding any stones out here. I don't know about you guys. Ooh, an egg! We got food! Yes, that's the best! Okay, so now we're not gonna die a terrible death. 
hopefully. I mean, I can't promise anything. We may well die a terrible death. But in the very least, we should go down valorously. Did you just... Did you just get a stick? A branch. Oh, that's nice. Well, there's nothing down here. That's not really the best. My word. Um... We're gonna have to backtrack to go find some more stone. Maurice, you need more points in finding stone because you're clearly not good enough at it. To pick up or gather from any environmental item or object, such as a plant or item, like furnaces, you can do the following. While facing the item, click or press the action hotkey. Select the pick up object option. <coughs> Use an item with digging, such as a shovel. Use an item with carving such as a sharp rock using your bare hands with no tool option one can sometimes harm you option two and three will decrease the durability of the item okay i see no we already know all this stop giving us useless hints game come on now are we back to where we started i'm gonna tell you not the best is that a shark oh my word there's a shark out there should we be careful of the shark do you think it can come onto the land do you think it's a land shark? I highly doubt it's a land shark. It's totally following us too. It is very closely following us. That is not the best. Not the best. I do not want to be followed by a shark. Okay, so so far we have failed. Hold up, wait a minute. Can I possibly? Ah, oh, this is where we get stone from. Well, that's sandstone, okay. This is not, this is not exactly what we were looking for, but it is close enough. Apparently, we have to hit these walls to get stone. That actually makes a lot of sense. And I should have realized that earlier, but I'm dumb. So unfortunate. What is this? Coal? Iron ore? I don't want iron ore. Come on now. I'm looking for legit, not sandstone stone. I feel like I'm going to starve to death at any moment. I don't like the prospects of that. The concept of starving to death is not fun to me. I don't want to die, but if I have to die, so be it. Oh, look, we can get stone from sandstone. There we go. Nice. Let's see. There are different environments in Wayward, some harsher than others. If you are in a desert, you may have to venture north to find different resources. Find a lush green forest and gather branches from a tree. Find large rocks on the ground or by gathering them from the mountainside. Okay. Gather them from the mountainside, eh? I can gather things from the mountainside. Let's cut our way into the sandstone and see what in the world could possibly be inside. I imagine there's not much more than death that'll be inside. It's unfortunate. Oh, we're encumbered. Um, pack on any more weight and you'll be fully overburdened. Begin to take damage. While moving, you can drop items from your, in from your inventory by right-clicking. Well, we don't need the sandstone. What do you mean, cannot drop sandstone here? Come on, drop the sandstone. Go for it. All the sandstone. We don't need it. Come on, pile of gravel. Who needs a pile of gravel? There's sand everywhere. It's close enough to gravel. You can, like, squeeze it together and make gravel. It's fine. Don't worry about it. No, 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 no. We didn't actually want to pick up any of that, but... You know, it's fine. Oh, we picked it up again. We need to stop walking into the stuff we drop. So, I'm not certain cutting into sandstone walls is the best way to get large rocks. But, I mean, it's definitely a way to get large rocks, I think. Maybe? I mean, there's no proof of that. There's snakes, too. You know what I don't like? Snakes. Snakes are the worst. Can we pick this up? Is this a thing we can pick up? I don't think so. Actually, let's go over here in actions. Inspect. You see sand. Okay, it's nothing. In reality, there's nothing there, even though we can clearly see that there's stuff there. I wonder what that plant is. Hello, slime. How you doing? I don't mean to be that guy. I'm not not here to fight you, slime. I'm just, just passing by. We tapped him on the head. We tapped him on the forehead. The slime doesn't seem to have cared, which is the ideal situation, because we do not want an angry slime on our hands. Oh, look at this. This is stone. Um... Yes, we got it. We got all the large stones we could possibly want. Apparently three of them. I will count three large rocks as as many as we could possibly want. 
rocks. I can't imagine any more large rocks. By now, you may have discovered that survival isn't easy. In order to survive, you will need to craft new items from the resources you gather. Press C to open the crafting window. Ooh. Oh, look at this. Look at all the stuff we can craft. Amazing. It will show you what you can make from the items in your inventory. Start by making a sharp rock, which is used in many crafting recipes. Not every attempt to craft an item is successful, and the chance depends on the skill level of the thing. Where's a sharp rock? Let's just craft a sharp rock anyway. Shut up. I don't want... I don't, I don't care. I don't care about your hint. Just get on with it. What do we got? With crafting knowledge under your belt, it's time to learn... Important survival lessons. Hunting. Equip two weapons or tools in your left and right hand. It's time to catch and cook some dinner. I like catching and cooking some dinner. Okay, what can we make here? A glass bottle of purified fresh water. Burn in a pit fresh water. Nobody wants you. What's it? A stone knife? Yeah. You joking? I was literally asking for a shiv earlier. I really want this shiv. No, wait. Let's just... Drag it over here. Now we've got a shiv in our hands. Perfect. Now that you are ready for battle, we totally are. Maurice, prepare yourself for battle. You shall go into the battlefield, and with any hope, you shall come out alive. If you do not, Maurice, I'm quite sorry. You are clearly not prepared for combat. So we have to get one piece of raw meat from maybe giant rats, spiders, chickens, maybe pin this rabbit in this hole. Get out of here, rabbit, you're done! You're done! Corpse carving. To harvest potential resources from this corpse, try carving it with a sharp item. I can do that. I can do that. Inspect. No. Okay. Let's... Can we inspect that? A rabbit corpse. Let's... Let's use our stone knife. We just put the stone knife on the ground. That's not the best. Let's see. Let's cue. Okay, it took me a second because I'm dumb, but I figured out how to do this. Okay, we need to click this. Carve. We have carved up the rabbit. Ooh, did we get bones? Is that a brain? Awful amount of organs, tissue, and other undesirable portions of an unlucky animal. That's a brain! Oh, man, just eat the brain, Maurice. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. <clears throat> Maurice is concerned about eating rabbit brains. I don't even know. Firestarter, we need to craft a wooden pole. I can do that. Easy. Oh, we need two. Okay, that's a bit more complicated, but not too complicated. What do we need next? A hand drill? What? That's a fire plow. A hand drill. A rudimentary fire-making tool, which uses a stick... And another piece of wood. Both hands are used to twist it against the wood, making friction to create an ember for the fire. Yes, I know all about that. Never done it because at this point in human history, it's just kind of dumb. But, you know, I mean, I'm sure it works really well. The final items we need are tinder and kindling. Gather the resources needed to craft both. Let's see, tinder and kindling we need twigs how do we get twigs can we just hit this tree until we get twigs that's a branch i want twigs ah there we go okay so we got one twig we just need another branch we can break it into even more twigs oh we got some twigs oh we got those twigs maurice you may not be good at finding stones or really doing much at all but you're definitely good at getting twigs that is i guess a thing i mean Good for you, Maurice. With the resources, craft some tinder and kindling. Oh, look, we've got some kindling. Oh, my word. And we'll make some tinder, not the app. What do you mean I failed to craft the tinder? Burn in a pit. I'm going to make all the tinder I want, game. Ugh. You could technically start a fire at this moment, but to make a proper enclosed fire source, you'll need to make a campfire. You'll need quite a few rocks for this endeavor. We have three out of five rocks. Oh, my word. Where's the rocks? There they are. Hey, rocks, I need more of you. Maurice is very interested in obtaining a large variety of rocks. Perfect. Perfect. Now we need to craft a campfire. So let's see. Cobblestone flooring, campfire. There we go. 
We failed to craft a camp failed to craft a campfire. There we go, we got the campfire. Maurice, you need to be more proficient at creating these things, Maurice. It's not that hard. Jeez, it's just a campfire, Maurice. What, what were you schooled in? Like, a pit? Did you just go to school in a gutter? Was your textbook a piece of, like, algae on the side of the street? That's not a good textbook, Maurice. I, I would think that that goes without saying. You don't have to have a PhD to understand that that's a bad way to learn things, Maurice. Come on now. With some items, you'll be able to build them. Oh, no. Why don't I just take this? Build it. What now? We built a campfire. Didn't even need the rest of your stuff. Use your hand drill and start the fire. That we can do. Okay, we failed to start a fire. Maurice, I know it's difficult, but come on. Jeez. Collect a utensil item. Now that you have a proper fire going, you can cook the meat. The craft recipe will be unlocked from the cooked form of this for the cooked form of this meat. You can even eat it after you are done if you are hungry and save it for later. One utensil item. Why do we need utensils? We're out in the middle of the wilderness. We don't need utensils. What are you on about? Well, I'm pretty sure we can easily make some delicious cooked meats. I'm on fire. Maurice, you just walked into the fire. What are you doing, Maurice? Oh, my word, Maurice. I don't even know. Get to the water, Maurice. Maurice, you jumped in the fire. You are insane. My word. Maurice is absolutely, completely insane. Are you still on fire, Maurice? You jumped in the water. You should be- Oh, I'm feeling the pain of burning. And now we're dehydrated. Oh no. This item requires you to be facing a fire source in order to craft it. We can do that. Purified water. Easy. Easy. Now, if you would mind, Maurice, could you- Could you drink the water? Thank you. I don't know what all of those things even were, but... I'm gonna guess they were all pretty good. Just gonna go with that. Now, fair note, how in the world do you make a utensil? Shut up. Shut up. Our axe is breaking. Oh, no. Oh, no. Look, we can make... We can make cooked meat now. You failed to cook the meat? Maurice, it's not that hard to cook meat. Jeez. What are you on about, Maurice? Maurice is like completely incompetent at this point. Maurice has no clue what's going on anymore. She's just like given up on surviving in general, Maurice. Try harder, Maurice. Come on. Drinkable water? Oh no. But we already had drinkable water. Are you a bit parched? No, I'm fine. Turn seawater into drinkable clean water. First you'll need to make a water skin to hold this water. We had a glass container we, we don't we don't need a water skin oh but we need to find a cactus needle or by sharpening down bones via crafting yeah, we can sharpen down some bones we have some bones right oh yeah oh yeah let's do this bone pole maurice stop failing at everything maurice you are the worst maurice is disgusting come on maurice there, we got a needle. Cordage? A very common resource for making many items in Wayward is string. By combining two items that are considered cordage, you can craft string. The cordage group is very diverse, including such things as stripped bark, crafted from tree bark, plant roots, seaweed, and more. See if you can find four of them. I'm pretty sure we can. Let's see. Stripped bark. Stripped bark. Stripped bark. And apparently we need more bark. Um, I'm gonna level with you. Maurice, I'm blaming you for not having enough bark at this point. Because you're disgusting, Maurice. You're the worst. There we go. We got four out of four cordage items. And now we can craft string. Oh, I love crafting string. That's so good. We failed to craft the string. Maurice, my wo We can make a shield! 
I mean, bugger to whatever they're telling us to do. We're gonna make a shield. Maurice, you're the best. Oh my word. Maurice is amazing. Get a stone knife and a freaking shield. Let's go find a rat and just absolutely slaughter the thing. Hey. Hey, is there anyone out here? I'm here to kill things. Maurice is here to lay down the pain, boy. It's looking like nothing actually wants to incur the wrath of Maurice right now. Oh my word. Come on, there's gotta be something. We just made a shield. We're prepared for anything. We want to kill! Pretty much just a living creature. I'm not very particular about what we kill in this situation. Snakes? Yeah, spiders. Perfect. Giant spider took some damage. Ha! Oh, wait. Okay, you failed to cause any damage to giant spider with a stone knife. Slashing damage appears to be ineffective. Oh, no! We're the worst. How about you just put that in your hand and bash the spider to death? Oh, yes! Wreck him! Oh, we're doing so much damage. What do we get? Silk? Oh, that's the best. I feel like we may have just won the game just by making a shield. The tutorial does not know what it's doing. Hey, rabbit, are you trying to, like, run from me here? I mean, really the best... Oh, we dropped the knife again. Really the best situation for the rabbit is, in fact, to run from me and definitely not to fight me, straight on. Maurice is way too effective at combat at this point. Maurice is some sort of, like, cold-hardened killer and just doesn't care at all about the life or liberties of really any other creature in the world because Maurice is the best. Well, I'm thinking with the slaughtering of a great evil spider with our wooden shield, which was totally the best move in the world, that will bring us to the end of this episode. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, like and subscribe. This has been Wayward, a survival turn-based game in which you can slaughter rabbits, beat a spider to death, and instead of doing whatever the tutorial says, build a bark shield instead and go on a killing spree. So until next time, thanks for watching, and of course, enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs>